Hi everyone, welcome to TechEdit. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to view and update data from WordPress to Firestore sub-collection. But first, I need to log in. Okay, I'm in. So if you don't know, um, this is a demo website and you can see a list of examples, a list of new cases that you can find and apply to your WordPress website such as um, display Firestore collection or display Firestore data so a lot of examples that you can use and today I'm gonna show you the example of uh, how to display Firestore sub collection as you can see I have a user collection and this is my user ID and under my user ID, I have a sub collection products. So, under product sub collection, we have some data, and we want to show the data under this sub collection. So, the current feature of the plugin supports showing collections, but it doesn't support sub collection in a way that you need to dynamically enter the Firebase UID. So, the existing um, shortcode does support uh, subcollection, but you need to specify a static path of the subcollection. So this will not be changed, and it still work. But somehow you want to show products for each login users. Then this is the new feature that just updated. Okay, let me show you. This is an example of getting the products. Under this product sub collection, we have two record, and to get that two record, you specify the get Firebase UID, and during the loading process, this get Firebase UID will be replaced by the login user UID. So that's why, by using this shortcode, you will be able to view the sub collection under this users so this is how it works the same thing with um, saving and updating um, data so in this example i have saved data to firestore database let me explain to you so this form is being created by contact form 7 you have few hidden view in the form so this will not show on the front end as you can see this is the example form. The form will save to users collection. The database type is Firestore. Okay, this is the main thing. For sub collection, you can use like user uh, some path and then products. It still works, but somehow you want to submit to this login user you must replace this one with get firebase uid so you replace this collection name with the users this will not be users anymore it's gonna be users get firebase uid products and after you submit the form it will submit under the uh, product sub collection here okay let's see how integrate firebase pro plugin support uh, sub collection okay so this is how you create a new record to a root collection or a sub collection by replacing the collection name if you have any question uh, please let me know see you in the next video bye